What's going on YouTube? King Dennis here. Today is April 18th, 2016. Um, today I will show you a video on trying to do things organically. And my method is using, using praying mantis or praying mantis. Now, fortunately, my local nursery, Kavina Garden Center, uh, happened to have these guys on sale because I believe they didn't have proper storage. And so they were hatching at the store. So... I, I really encourage the nursery to go ahead and just release them in their garden and so hopefully they can provide um, safety and and protection in their garden nursery and at the same time hopefully leave some uh, eggs. Now these uh, normally sell out for I believe 10 to $12 um, and they come with two egg cases. Um, it says here approximately 200 eggs per case. So... Um, you can have up to 400 praying mantises uh, in your garden area. Um, they usually will eat aphids, thrips, grubs, mites, and other small insects. And uh, they get a lot bigger than these guys. And I think they, they do the trick in staying better in your backyard because unlike ladybugs, these guys don't have wings and can just fly off once you release them. Um, last year, I, I released like about... 5,000 ladybugs and within about three days they were gone from my area These guys tend to stay a little bit longer um, providing that I I leave a lot of uh, Bugs for them to consume um, Yeah, I mean these are praying mantis hopefully they can uh, protect my yard right now I've been dealing with a, a couple gray and green aphids um, It hasn't been too much out of a control but they are starting to appear, um, as is with my spider mites. And the spider mites are, are hitting more of my lemon balm, uh, a couple of my tomatoes, and some cucumbers. Uh, and it's all in one area, which is uh, my hydroponics uh, setup. And so, for now, I have released most of them in the yard. Uh, and I have these guys here to stay in here so that they can get a little bit bigger. Um, what I can do is do some rotation of plants that I think may be infected with um, aphids and so they can be fed and uh, protect, the, protect the yard and so hopefully I can get some of these guys to reproduce and leave some more eggs uh, for me so then uh, I can try to do things more organically so again you can get these on Amazon um, but preferably you try to get them at your local uh, garden center um, between 10 to $12 and uh, they're more effective than I believe ladybugs so alrighty guys if you like this video please do click the thumbs up mm -hmm. uh, subscribe if you haven't already and feel free to share this video uh, with your friends thanks for watching